Millions of children, particularly girls, are at grave risks of harm as the COVID-19 pandemic threatens to devastate the education, health, leaving them at risk of abuse. Quarantine measures imposed as a response to the pandemic are putting children at heightened risk of violence in home and cutting them off from essential protection services, education, and vital support. Indeed, Google searches for domestic violence indicate a spark in the number of people searching for help dealing with domestic violence and sexual harassment in Africa since the start of the COVID-19. In Kenya, for instance, calls for help against domestic violence have increased by 34% in the first three weeks of 7 p.m. to 5 a.m. curfew. Local gender and health authorities have been working along with non-governmental organizations like the United Nations Plan International to combat the triggering effects of COVID-19 on the increase of child violence. We believe that these efforts need to be bolstered by young, innovative minds and ideas that tend to address the problem in a more accelerative way. There have been similar projects like this, and there will be others, but my startup tends to solve the problem that most startups have escaped. TechHealth seeks to provide a more reliable and simpler medium for risk communication, information dissemination, and gender-based violence reporting. Our on-the-go services include mobile emergency hotline for people dwelling in selected countries, an interactive mobile application that converts health and gender awareness news into various global and local languages. With integrated health reporting portal where emergency incidents are reported and sent to relative governmental and non-governmental health organizations and gender response agencies. Our weekly newsletters and data updates are appreciatively trending. By our percentage, we are at 50%. We have a fully functional and hosted website that is being accessed by the public. Our news feed port is active and highlights major health outbreaks and preventive measures on our platform. Our subscribers receive weekly newsletter and our social media platforms are used to feature our news and updates. Currently, we are in need of financial support to fast forward the development of our mobile application which encompasses of both Android and iOS. We also need recommendations from international organizations and national governing bodies to enable us fully operating countries that a solution will be rolled up in. We want to set up a station in selected countries which will enable us to manage information and relate with relevant partners and national authorities. That with the above mentioned assistance and with our technical know-how, we can solve the prevailing problems.